Good afternoon, my dear brothers and sister and friends around the world. Happy afternoon. I just came from the uh, East Valley Pentecostal Church, which is in San Jose at White Road and Kumbi Road. And today there was extremely presence of the Lord was there and everybody filled with the Spirit. So that's why I share all the time so that whenever you have an opportunity to stop by at San Jose East Valley Pentecostal Church, which is in San Jose, California, USA, at White Road and Kumbi Road, and then you personally feel the presence of the Lord. Because it is in the Bible, taste and see, the Lord is good, bless is the man who trusts in him. Because we are the people, unless we don't see from our eyes, we don't hear from our ear, we don't feel in our heart, then it is very difficult to trust. But I felt it. That's what I'm sharing with you. So if you are in the United States, when the Lord provides you an opportunity to come to uh, San Jose, then please, Sunday, we have two services. One started at 10 o'clock to 11, half an hour break, then Jubilee service from 11.30 onward. How much time the Lord will take me? We don't go by set schedule. We go by how the Lord takes us. Okay, and the pastor over there, Brother Rodney, he is the servant of God, has a zeal to bring many souls towards the Lord. So today I am going to share with you from the, book, from the Holy Book of Leviticus, Lesson 10, verse 1, 2, 3. Then Nadab and Abihu, the sons of Aaron, Nadab and Abihu, the sons of Aaron, each took his censer and put fire in it, put incense on it, and offered profane fire before the Lord. My dear brothers and sisters and friends, whenever we go against the God, whenever we go against the will of God, whenever we try to open our mouth against the God, our God is a fire, like fire when broke into the house, it destroy everything. When fire broke into the wilderness that killed so many animals, trees, miles and miles, our God is a fire. I will pray for all of the people in the world, never ever open your mouth against the will of God, against God, because our God is a God of fire. Whenever we do against the God, we should be ready to face the consequences. But our God is a God. He is slow in anger, but abundance in mercy. It doesn't mean sometime God gives you time to repent, to relent, to repent, to relent. How much you repent and how much you relent after doing something wrong. If you really repent from bottom of your heart, He is a God who forgives. But sometime when God told you, do not do this, and you do the do you do against the will of God? Then what happened? Aaron, Moses, brother, Moses' right hand, whom Lord speak face to face, even Aaron, the priest, 
Lord speaks to him face to face. And he ordained his four sons, Nadab, Abihu, Itamar, and Eliezer. He made them priests that they may serve him and teach Moses teach through Aaron and Aaron also teach them that this way we have to worship the Lord our God. Then why they put the profane fire in front of the Almighty God, creator of heaven and earth, how he will accept the profane offering? He is a holy God. He is a king of kings. He is the Lord of lords. He is a creator of universe. When they put the profane fire in front of the Lord, Lord killed Nadab and Abu right away. When we read this, any parents would have heard any parents parents cannot bear this kind of loss but that's the mistake we did Lord doesn't like the blunder mistake God doesn't like that anybody put his hand or put his mouth against God because God loves everybody around the world he gives sunshine to every person in the world whether they are Japanese or American or Russian or Indian or Chinese or Vietnamese whatever Lord loves everybody then how come somebody open their mouth against He is a God who created the heaven and earth. He is a God. He created all things in his own time. He is a God he created of time. He is a God. He has created us from creation of this world and he has, he has anointed us in our mother's womb when we didn't come up from our mother's stomach then how can we how can we have courage to speak against god when we know that the meaning of hallelujah is praise the lord after hearing praise the lord we make mock of almighty god my dear brothers and sisters and friends he is a jealous god wasting the iniquity of the father upon the children to the third and fourth generation who hates him but showing mercy to thousand who love him and keep his commandment so my dear brothers and sisters and friends I pray you I beg you because I don't want that anybody after hearing this video after going to the church after knowing about the Bible speak or open their mouth against Almighty God God is going to punish my dear brothers and sisters and friends. He can punish me if I open mouth against God. I will never do that. The same thing because Lord sent his angel through this video. I can just request them please do not open your mouth after knowing the reality Hallelujah mean praise the Lord. When you know the meaning of praise the Lord, because Lord is worthy by the praise, we have to glorify Him. He is only worthy to be praised. So please do not open your mouth against God. I never force anybody or I never, I don't want to tell anybody that whomsoever they are believing, no problem.
बिलीव बट दैट इज माई टेस्ट मनी आई हैव टेस्टेड द लॉर्ड इज गुड ब्लस इज द मैन हु ट्रस्ट इन हिम सो इफ यू बिलीव इन दिस वीडियो सो प्लीज नेवर ओपन योर माउथ अगेंस्ट गॉड हु इज अ क्रिएटर ऑफ हेवन एंड अर्थ वेन ही लवस यू he may punish you too if you don't walk away from your wicked ways if you don't walk away from doing something wrong and we know when we do something wrong and we know when we do something right we know that lord gave us the free will use it or misuse it when we open our mouth against god we are using the free will against god and when we open our mouth hallelujah praise the lord holy 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 god almighty my dear brothers and sisters and friend if we don't praise the lord lord will let the stone speaks for him and we want at least better than stones people kick the stones here and there and you do not know where the stone goes we lord made us far 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 better than stones lord gave us the authority to control everything so please control your tongue before speaking do not hurt do not curse your neighbor do not curse your parents so that you can prolong the days of your life if you obey your parents you will prolong the days of your life if you curse you will diminish the days of your life so please i will bring some more good news from the lord god almighty so please do not open your mouth against the god because god is a jealous god wasting the iniquity upon the upon the father to the third and fourth generations who hates him but showing mercy to thousands who love him and keep his commandment so brothers and sister please love all your country your government your prime minister or president and love your neighbor love everybody that's what we come to the world that's why god expect from us love your neighbor like your own enemies in jesus name i pray